Hi everybody, it's Amy from Bargain Beauty and I went to the bigger Dollar Tree in my area and I got the Bolero products, guys. So if you guys are frustrated and feeling like your store may never get them, they are just putting them out in my store so your store still has hope that they're going to get them. I do have one question for you guys. If you could let me know, they had the Apple Cinnamon Hand Wash but I did not find it in the vanilla scent. I wanna know if you guys saw the vanilla cream in the hand wash, or did they just have it in the apple cinnamon? I'm thinking they must have had it in the hand soap in the vanilla, but I didn't see it. And they had literally just put the displays out. Maybe somebody had grabbed them, I don't know. But let me know in the comment section, guys, please. So I did purchase quite a few items, and I did that because I want to make gift baskets for Christmas and I want to keep some products for uh, my daughter and myself. So let's get right into it. Well, first, um, I told you guys the other day in my Dollar Tree video, these are the two books that I actually purchased um, the other day. I wanted to show you guys this cookbook because I couldn't believe it was a dollar. It is absolutely gorgeous. It's a nice, thick book, but look at the images inside, guys. Let me back the camera up a little bit. This is such an amazing cookbook for just a dollar. I think it is gorgeous. Even just the display in your kitchen, obviously to use as well, but just the imagery alone is amazing and the recipes seem pretty simple, um, but healthy, a lot of them healthy options. So if you guys see this book, The Yummy Supper, I would definitely pick it up. It is an awesome find for just a buck. It's like a coffee table book. And then I did grab the South Beach Diet, and I just want to read it. And if I don't read it, or if I don't follow it, I'll just donate it. All right, so I did find the body creams. I got two of each, two of the apple cinnamon and two of the vanilla cream. I did use one of these, and it was the vanilla one. And I got to say, it absorbed right into my skin, and it smelled I can still smell it. It smells good. It doesn't smell too strong at all. It's not that overpowering smell. And I love that it soaked right into my skin. It didn't lay on the top of the skin. It wasn't greasy or oily. So if you guys were wondering, um, so far so good. Now I did grab two. They had more of the bath bombs, but I only grabbed two. I grabbed the oatmeal shea and I grabbed the almond honey. They did have other ones, but those are the two that I grabbed. I don't know how well these bath fizzes work, so I didn't wanna grab a bunch of them. And then I did get the face, skin, and hair body oil. I got the apple cinnamon, and I got the vanilla cream. Now, it's probably like old news for you guys, but it's kinda new news for me because my store just didn't have these. The one near me doesn't have them at all. They don't get Bolero ever. I did get one bar of soap for the vanilla cream and one of the apple cinnamon. And I got two of the facial wipes. I think this is a really good deal for 30 count. Um, I don't know how apple cinnamon is going to be on my face, but we shall see. And the vanilla cream. Actually, let's open them up. Oops, I'm dropping stuff now. Let's open this right up. Let's see if it's really strong scented. I don't want to irritate my skin, but I wanted the whole set. I'm sure we've all got caught in that trap before, right? Let me take that off. I'll put it back on in a second. Oh, uh, they're the wipes I don't love. I like the wipes that have, like, good density and they're really moist, but not, like, I know that word's not a popular word, but um, they have enough liquid on them. These are those dry wipes. That funky material, you know how it feels kind of like a cleaning cloth, but not like a cleaning cloth for your face in a good way. But let's see how large they are. Sorry guys, I'm doing my best. I'm holding the camera with the other hand. Hold on. So they're a good size wipe, but I'm not a fan of this. See, see the texture? Not a fan of that. Bummer. I'm going to wipe my face. Let me see. Sorry, I took my glasses off. Um, it's those wipes that are really good when you don't have makeup on, just want to wash your face before bed, but not really a wipe I think would be 
great for taking your makeup off. That's just my opinion. Maybe you will think differently. Now I have sensitive skin, so I just wiped it across my face. I'm gonna do it one more time, and I'll let you guys know. See, like, there's not enough. It's dragging across my face. Totally dragging. It's not like got enough liquid on it to like feel refreshing. It feels more dry. I don't love it. I don't love it. But maybe my daughter will like it. I feel a little teeny stinging. But again, I have sensitive skin. And just feeling it on my cheeks. So, I don't know. Don't believe the hype on those. Bummer. I thought that was such a good deal. 30 of them. And the scent doesn't smell as strong as the other scents in the same I'll pick that up one second um, it doesn't smell as strong as these it is much lighter but yeah no oh well okay so then let me pick this up okay if it wants to stay up we shall see probably not okay so then I got two of the body washes and two in each scent and then I did get two each of the bath soaps in each scent and like I showed you guys before the liquid hand soap I got in the apple um, scent I'm so bummed I really want it in both scents I don't know and then I did find one palette of the LA colors this was randomly thrown in a bin in the bottom of a shelf and I just happened to find it. So these must have came in there at some point, obviously, and were gone like immediately because I didn't see them last time. And like I just said, I saw literally one of these. I'm excited to have the one though. This would be the one that I wanted out of all of them. So I guess, I guess I'm guess i still kind of lucky because I did get the one I wanted even though I didn't get all of them, I got the one I wanted. And then, I don't know if you guys have seen these, but they have the little five packs of the like generic cereal. It's like generic of the Apple Jacks and the Captain Crunch and stuff like that. Let me see if I can get back there a little better. Um, I don't have these in my local store, but they had them in this store. So I did grab two of these. Why not? Um, they're normally in my store, almost $4 and sometimes over $4 for eight of them. So there's five of these for a buck. I think it's a good deal. And I did grab one more of the white chocolate um, frappe candle because I absolutely love that candle. I know it's a personal preference, but I really love it. And then I grabbed three of these bags. They're the larger size bags because the ones that I got at Dollar Tree last time with the trucks and like the scenery, those are like more of a small to medium size and I needed some larger bags and these are perfect. I absolutely love them. I would even love framing this wreath. I think the wreath is absolutely gorgeous and I wish I could find a real wreath in real life like that one. So yeah guys that is my DT haul and thank you so much for watching. I don't know if I'm going to put the um, footage. Yeah my face doesn't feel good after that wipe. It feels very dry. Oh that's a bummer. Um, I don't know if I'm going to put the footage from in the store in this video or if I'm going to put it in a separate video. So you're either going to see it now or be on the lookout for a second video with in-store footage. So thank you guys so much for watching. Please make sure to hit the thumbs up button or the thumbs down. Either way, it doesn't matter. I just appreciate when you hit it because then it gets more people to see my videos. It puts it out in circulation and I really appreciate that so much. So have a great day or night, whichever one you're watching. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye.